On this season of Matt Wars King of the Mat, we bring you the same fast-paced grappling action, only this time with a twist. Our champion won't know who his match is against or if it's gi or no gi, but there's even more at stake. Whoever wins won't just win the match, but will win the right to continue his reign as Matt Wars King of the Mat. Going into there, what's the thoughts? Cool as a cucumber, man. I'm ready to go. Not nervous at all. There's no like butterflies or anything? Or... No, definitely I get a little bit of butterflies, but gotta like harness it, try and overcome it and use it for power, you know, make it energy. Is there a g game plan in there? You know, get in and out quick as possible kind of thing? Yeah, game plan is always to finish it within regulation. Okay. I'd, uh, I'd like to avoid going to overtime, but there are guys that just try and get to overtime, so, you know, everyone has their own sort of strategy in the EBI rules, but I always look for the finish, and that's what I'm going to try and do tonight.
had a lot. <laughs> <laughs> I've had a lot to think about. I, I haven't watched the first match, but I watched the second one, and definitely a lot of areas. I, I saw I did a lot of things right. Like I, I, I got a nice entanglement near the end there, but I, I think I jumped to my finishing mechanics before I cinched up my dig mechanics for the leg locks, and I, I just gotta, just gotta refine those things, and then uh, yeah, work on my back control a little bit more. Uh, a few things I saw that I didn't do well, so. Uh, yeah, just I'm, I'm happy with how I did. I mean, I'm not happy that I didn't win, but I, I felt like I was right in there with them. And uh, yeah, I lost to the guy who who won. That, that shocked, I think, all of us when he beat Chase. So, you know, props to him. But uh, I'm definitely glad that I don't have to pop knees right now like yeah. he does. Mentally speaking, I mean, you know, sometimes feeling that you were beaten by the eventual winner. Does does that make you feel any better? Or are you just like, fuck, I wish I beat him, because then I could be the winner? Yeah, you never know, right? Like, there's no such thing as jujitsu math. Like, if I won and went on to face Chase, who knows what kind of match that would have yielded, right? Because, uh, you know, we probably would have had a leg lock showdown, which is something I'd like very much. But, um, but yeah, no, I, I mean, yeah. I, I, I do, in a, in a small way, feel better, I guess, but not really. I still lost, right? So. Take it for what it's worth. It's still not, even though someone else win at one, won, it wasn't me. So that's something that eats at me. But I mean, the guy had so much heart, as we saw. Like he mentioned that I popped his knee, and <laughs> you know, props to him for being a tough son of a bitch. But uh, yeah, I think I think next time I'm really just gonna have to focus on how can I break this man's leg rather than get him to tab. <laughs> <laughs> was it was it a, a good trip overall? You enjoyed? You were happy? to come down to Portland and do Submission Underground? Oh yeah, it was a great experience. Had some great company, Matt Sargent and uh, this guy Jeremy Brand. <laughs> <laughs> it, was, uh, it was a great time, man. I love coming down to the States to compete and getting some different roles with some of the top guys in the area. You know, I, f I didn't feel like I was really outclassed at all or out strength, which was nice. And uh, yeah, I, th I think I can take a lot of positives and a lot of things that I can learn from in this experience and that's all it is right it's just experience that's why we all do this so but no it was it was great do you hope to get on the next card yeah absolutely if they'll have me uh, i'd love to have a match with that chase kit i think a lot of people would like to see the leg lock systems going up against each other and uh and really see who can get in there and finish those leg locks i got a lot of respect for him i think he did look a little bit tired in the third match because just fought Howie, who's like considerably bigger and stronger. He had an amazing leg lock on him, so I think like me versus Chase Davis would be really cool, or whoever else they want to give me. There's a few guys in the Northwest area that would be great. And uh, yeah, I'm just looking to compete whenever I can get the opportunity, so for sure.